The Daily Mirror has released an article regarding CMS. And what I'd like to know is what is the most shocking element of this article and the issues in CMS? From my perspective, I would say the fact that they've reported that there's £3.7 billion of fictitious arrears from the old child support agency. And they've highlighted that that money has been dragged over into the child maintenance service and that 3.7 billion is being put onto paying parents accounts and they are being forced to pay these fictitious debts all this money just keeps appearing on um from my understanding on the portals where the paying parent can log on, log in and see how much money they've paid um or and what their next monthly installment is supposed to be and all of a sudden they keep getting all of these arrears this the national audit office has been raising these red flags i've read all of their reports going back to 2006 and it's the same thing every year annually um you know uh, regarding this this 3.7 billion that the child maintenance service are trying to um collect um the fact that the dwp have admitted that they have inflated incomes by 300 percent is as a scare tactic is completely unacceptable you know i personally believe that there's a lot of criminal elements that's going on here regarding the child maintenance service and they must be held to account the police the national crime agency and the serious fraud office need to investigate what's going on and if that means that they've got to commandeer their computers and go through everything then they have because in my opinion um there's a lot of innocent pain parents that are taking their own lives as the way that the child maintenance service is operating